Hi there. Welcome to Frank Adams Rose Vase Testing Week. We're vase testing for Equatorian Flower and Eco Roses this week. And we're doing whites, creams, and greens. We're opening this session with Playa Blanca. It's definitely one of the nation's favorite white roses. It's got this beautiful large head, creamy, with a twirly center in it. This is pretty with the three centers. This is day four of a vase test. We've had these roses in water out of the cooler since Monday and today's Thursday. So we're on day four with Equatorian flowers and eco roses. I'm gonna take a tour around here and take a close look at all of these varieties they sent. We're moving on to lemonade. Lemonade's a pretty green rose. The shades vary a little bit from a light yellow to a deeper green. As it opens, it gets a little lighter in the center with a nice ruffly edge. Lemonade. Next is Vendela. Sorry, you're hearing, our, uh, you're hearing our phone in the background. That's what that beeping noise is. We're open for business today. We have these roses out on display each time we vase test for farms. This is Vendela. And it's interesting with Vendela, you can get kind of a really pretty ivory and sometimes it has more of a ivory peachy center. And you see those intonations even within the same bunch of roses. Next we have Aikido. Sorry, not Aikido, this is Eskimo. You too. An Eskimo. What I like about Eskimo is that it folds back in that traditional rose shape with the nice triangular shaped petals around the edges. And it's next to Tibet. Tibet's also a really beautiful favorite white rose. On day four here, this Tibet is all the way open and you're looking about six to seven inches across as it's open here. Down here we have Proud. Proud's a larger, taller, um, white rose. You're seeing a little bit of scarring here. Seems to be pretty much standard with some white roses. They're, they're temperamental. So always plan to have just a few extra stems when you're ordering white roses. That was proud. And now we're onto a garden rose here. This is White O'Hara. And White O'Hara has a little bit of a pinky peach, pe pinky peach center to it. It's a very large headed white garden rose opening to seven plus inches as it's in full bloom here. Aikido. Akita's always been one of my favorites. These bunches are not completely open. And again, this is day four. So if you're using Akita, I highly recommend that you get them in water, out of the cooler, a couple of days at least before you're wanting to use them so you can see them in their full splendor. Next, we have Cream Unique. And it's a nice ivory with green outer petals. Also pretty large, it's looking about a four inch head height to it. And green fashion. Green fashion looked pretty green on days one and two. As it's opening here, you're seeing a really nice blushy pink center with green outer petals. Yeah. And we're going to Polar Star. Polar Star's large headed cream rose opens more cream than it does white. Next we have Alba. Okay. 
And now we have white chocolate. White chocolate's an extremely large-headed white rose, and as it's opening here, it's hard to tell, but if I pick it up, it covers my whole hand. So this is like seven inch bloom across right now on day four. Now we're onto Moonstone. Moonstone has this beautiful ruffly edge. Little green on the outside, little cream in the center. Now we have Jade. Between Jade and its neighbor Green Tea, it looks like green tea over here has more of a solid green to it. Jade's showing some yellow as it opens. Both are performing quite nicely. Then we have Equatorian flower and eco roses in this face test on day four. Mondial. Mondial varies a little bit. This has a little more green. The green fades away to the outer petals as it opens. Okay, I'm gonna back up so we can see all these roses together now. One thing I'm noticing as we pull away is that this white O'Hara really stands out, as does this Tibet. So keep your eye on Tibet in the corner back there as we back away when we show how big these roses became in four days. Um, Tibet seems to be the whitest with the largest opening head. Larger than Tibet was Polar Star, but Polar Star definitely takes on a, a creamy tone. Moonstone. Playa Blanca. Playa Blanca is just gorgeous. White chocolate. This was white and green roses. Four days out of water. Sorry, four days out of the cooler in preserved water at Frank Adams. Base testing for Equatorian flower and eco roses. Stay tuned next week while we base test pinks from light to hot. Thanks.